Yo, 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 what's up? This your boy Black Truth. This your boy Black Truth, and I'm back again. I'm back again with a new story out of Waycross, Georgia. Yeah, you heard me, Waycross, Georgia. Georgia family says cops shot at a car full of unarmed children. On August 8th, 8 a.m., there were five children. Five children were driving home from Walmart. The oldest was 16. Two officers got behind these children, ordered them to pull over. The 16-year-old pulled the car over. Once he did, the officers ordered these children out of the car. The 16-year-old was so scared, he told his three young siblings to run home to their father. I can kind of understand why he did that, especially with what's going on with the police brutality, Black Lives Matter movement. It's just a lot going on right now. The kids got out, the three kids in the back, took off running, and the two officers started to shoot at them. They shot at them for no apparent reason. And once they didn't hit those children, they went to the front of the vehicle, snatched the other kids out of the vehicle, and started to pistol whip them. Yes, they shot at the three that ran, and they pistol whipped the two that stayed. My God, what is going on in this world today? Why do we have to keep dealing and, and putting up with this? It's bad that us as parents have to go through this, but when our children have to go through this, God help us all. And to add, Waycross, Georgia is near the place where Amon Arbery got slayed as well. I want you guys to watch a small part of this clip and I'm going to put the description, I'm going to put the link of, of this video in the description, and I want y'all to watch the whole video, but I'm going to show you a little part of it, man, y'all tell me what you think, like, share, subscribe, leave comments in the comment section. Play different teams around the nation, so we, they had to take the press at Walmart, but our kids were excited because one of our children plays a game in 10 and one plays a 6, so we was going to Jacksonville today, we was going to have a whole football day, we were going to run a motel room, and Go to his, his, his game, take him out to eat after we go to our other son game. We kind of stay down there, take him to the pool, let him chill out. Well, the kids were so excited, they jumped the gun. My 16 year old jump up while we get dressed, and he takes them to catch the bus because they had to go on the bus at 8.30. So I noticed that it was about 8 o'clock, they had eight in the breakfast to come back. So the car told him, man, man y'all come back. We didn't give y'all permission to the car, y'all come on back. As we wait for them to come back, we hear gunshots like coming from our backyard. We go in the back and we open the door, we see my nine year old. My, my, my 12 year old, my 14 year old running from the police behind them with gunshots coming behind them. We go down the street and, and uh, we see our 15 year old and our 16 year old on the ground. Also, a man handling them. Our 15 year old bleeding from the face where the police that pistol was and bullet holes in our car. They right here at their house. So, yeah, man, I'm going to put a link to this video in the description box. And I want y'all to go check it out, man. I want y'all to like, share, subscribe, and tell me what you think about this in the comment section, man. Man, this is crazy, y'all.